It's a wonder some of these up and downs still work. Guess they built machines better in the past. The spent nuclear fuel that Toxanol dumped in the surf had detrimental effects on the marine habitats, while the overflowing landfills contaminated the groundwater. Combined, this sent their world hurtling on an inevitable road to ruin. Pollution bad. <laughs> I need to brush up on my Wando, but I have a feeling he believes it was you that caused the bang at the yard. Hi, why, love dark. Oh, and he says he knows you. You used to call him Gizmo. He gave you the oil-greased hands when he taught you how to upcycle. <laughs> Gizmo remembers you as a nice kidling, and he can still sense the warmth of your good heart. <laughs> But Gizmo says how you experience a memory can be different. You know the story, but sometimes the truth it brings is personal. I remember you too. He hopes you remember that one time he taught you to upcycle and hopes you've had some use for it over the years. He understands history made Loopa Lupin a big part of your past, your present, and soon, your future. You still believe there's some good in everyone. You still have hope for tomorrow. He says you should know that what's meant to be will always find a way, but history shouldn't consume you. Ouch. I want revenge. Gizmo understands you still have strong feelings, but urges you to keep them under control. You've witnessed firsthand what it'll lead to. Yes, that's the way. No arguing with that. Light lets that me see. That is how you shine light at the dark. Seriously, don't doubt the dark. Oh. I'm so proud of you for doing the right thing. Can't believe you let that loser sway you. Hard to believe the world is actually going to survive. Just seemed impossible till now. Oh. Grateful to you for coming back and doing your best to change things. You were the only chance they had. Wonders if you liked working with the Myriad. They always seem so centered and so seeking. But that's not important now. Gizmo says it's taken a long time to bring the past up to the present. And where you go from here is up to you. You need to set the past aside, at least for now. So he's gone. Come down. He can't leave the Underyard as he has no protection against the vacuum in the dead zone. So you need to salvage scrap to upcycle the Mecton, starting with the old crate outside. <laughs> you should return when you've retrieved the scrap. There's no time to waste if you want to make the What's a jumbo pot? That's what he decided to call it after he saw it for the first time. It's big and fluffy. That's accurate enough. If you can see past the blue color, that is. Okay. Yes, I'm gonna get a scrap for this. Back. Yeah, I'm gonna be using it also. Uh. Hazard so this zone are vast area covered in deadly hazard. Tell me you stand a hazard for so long before it kills you. Several type hazard, bio contaminated, cryogenic, incendiary, radioactive, and oxygen deprived that zone. Here and resistor chose to bring character creation to determine how long you can survive in the hazard zone and how much damage you can take from the hazard weapon. With resistance of hundred to a type of hazard, you resist hundred percent of the damage for all. So I'm new if I'm Something's going on. Uh, Nothing but dead air here. Guess that is oxygen deprived zone. Let's see, let's see. Trail or main? Still main. This 
They're short of breath and death to this zone. Better take care. He who half breathes, half lives. That's the leftover you're looking for. Where? Dark in here. On a climbing spot, use the normal movement control to go like slash jump to stop climbing. Oh shit. Let's see, let's see. We have here. Leather coat. Oh. Reduces my key energy and energy regen, but. Let's give me some armor. Chuck again. Just now was 256. Any kind of protection, you take it. a bit of a key energy oh it's a, oh it's a okay it's a tight rope it's supposed to go there nice view Stay away from that biohazard, you'll want to wash yourself off for a month. Oh. Uh, my HP is going down real fast. It's a wild sensation. Hello, Koti. On a Mechtron art box. From the open air. Ventilator. Okay, I got a bunch of stuff. Oh. Nails. What's this? A mask. Wear the mask. You don't have the oh, not enough level. Uh, what else I can wear? Not enough level. This more again. Wrong way. This way. He says that's enough to get the Mechton functional. You'll have an engine, a fuel soaker, a gun, and a gathering net, but no armor, nor enough oxygen. So good. He made a suction device so the Mecton can use the black tar as an instant refuel. You can also use it to clear oily goo puddles so you can pass and access hard to get to areas. He's been working on another project for the Mecton, a cannon but it needs ammunition, and by that he means the scripts. He says if they're trained right, they'll turn into a distraction for the Jumbo Puff. The best way to find scripts is to go talk to Moog. He knows the ins and outs of every breathing thing left alive after the apocalypse. Unfortunately, this means you'll have to venture farther out into What's the dead squeak? zone. 
It's a little feisty and tough critter. Critter. A perfect fit for a live ammunition, if you ask it. Customize your Vectron. Nice. Back. Let's talk about script. The Mectron can't cross oil pools. Can use it to remove oil. Okay. Um. It's not so dark out anymore. So what did I just pick up? Here, bean. Thing. The grease monkey's mecton is built sturdy, just like himself. Can you imagine how this place used to look before the dead oil flood? What's that? Might want to hold your breath before you head any further. You're about to witness the breathtaking vistas of what's known as the Dead Zone. Dead In zone. the old world, roads like this really led somewhere. Now, most of them lead to disaster. Nice. Looks pretty. Pretty destructive. Oh, zombies or something. Get a bit first. Power. Dead on. Boom. Imagine that. You could just go to a place like this to get a proper meal back in the old world. What are those? Is they dead now? Don't pass out. Ankle bands. Shit. Oh. Oh no. <laughs> that was out of the it's weird. Hopefully, the checkpoint is not too far. loading this is a bit long okay back I want to go in and explore what do we have here tap dish Keep your feet beneath you. Spring up. What the hell? The duck helmet. Okay. 
a spike. Duck. <laughs> oh my goodness, he's a big duck helmet. Let's be careful this time. I can't suck the group out of this area. That over there is Steepo Depot, the cliffside that Moog hangs on to. Back to sneaking around. Gave me this song. <laughs> it gets repetitive though. <laughs> this a weird song. Your ears just pooped. Oh, checkpoint in signpost. Let's see. This one's impressed to see you out here. He figured you'd be dead by now. Not many are as tough and clever as you must be. How do you know me? Says a monster hunter hears many a things from the window. Moog says that all your power doesn't do you a bit of good if you're not willing to pull the trigger when the time comes. Bestilga. Choosing what to kill and what to spare are the most important decisions you'll make. Go. You might have a steady aim, but you need to be sure that you pick your targets with care. It's hard to make those life or death decisions for others, but someone's got to do it. Otherwise, they'll do it themselves, and you know they'll miss. Uh, you kill Claims whoever you like. kills whoever he doesn't like. Says it's wild that the world seems to be coming back, but he supposes that means more monsters for him to shoot. Wonders why you work so hard to keep things alive. Bullets help thin the herd instead. Says you should give up on working with the stubborn myriad. He keeps trying to put out their lights and they keep putting up new ones. Why take out their lights? Says they keep the monsters away. He needs them closer, not farther. But enough of that, right? He says the wildlife, nature, has changed and turned against us. Instincts of survival took over when the world changed. He's not sure about their veggie diet anymore, and if it's changed, who knows what it's done with the chemical composition of their body output. Right now, though, he feels he's come to a point where he's got a pretty clear idea on the whereabouts of monsters, both tall and short. Why are you tracking monsters? Says as big as they are. The world is bigger. To find where they are, you need to see where they've been. Sure. Moog says you must learn to walk before you can run. It takes practice before you can call yourself a monster hunter. Fortunately for you, he, can help. he understands you need to start off with something small before you go big. There's no better place to start than a squip cave. Squip Hunting cave. down a couple of these little critters for yourself should keep you on your toes. I'm ready to shoot, I'm ready to hunt. you stick to the haunting and shots present themselves later. Uh, oh wait, a more quest? Moog says you should go hunt for squip. Yeah. Shit, but 
What's that? Can I... Can I have that? That's a quest? Find this Roto. Yeah. Sob about the thin air later. That's a grotto. Wait, it's the script hole up. Place is just filled with critters. can up one of my skills uh where is it where is it because bubble yes do even more now turn it once the volatilization from the nuclear waste evaporated a volatile gas rose through the soil and infested structures, even Toxanol's own buildings. So, in a way, they caused their own death. Mm. Get to go down. What I... What I even use... Oh! No, 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 not a goop. Oh. Let's hold there. Can I? No. Can't get to it. Yes, I can bounce up. <laughs> okay, let's try bouncing up. Boing. Nice. Something over there. Oh, is that a script? Back, come on. Looks like the switches need to be turned to match so enough charge can flow through the conductors. Just a few moves left, make them count. Oh my god, I made a mistake in game. Right. Good. That's enough electric current to initiate the actuators and activate the framework. Oh, something here. 
A new weapon. Keep your powder dry. So, Bang Bitsky, Jupskit, Jups, <laughs> Judge Spitzo. Okay, let's try it out. Uh. No range weapon. Don't forget the past. Learn from it. Oh, what is it? Is it a pistol? Let's see, a uh, range combat. I want to try double do wielding, but yeah, let's try do wielding. How do I do? These are crafting materials. That's for someone a little bit more advanced. But where do I access the weapons? Oh good, do a quick save first. Okay, right. Back. It's torso, right shoulder, left shoulder. Quest item. Okay, I'm guessing can't change that. Oh, okay, we both guns already. Nice, nice. Uh, something I miss. Oh, a script. Wait, kill the creature. No, pet kill the creature. <laughs> like my dark hat. Uber Blue Blade. Yep. Uh, okay, it's a bladed weapon. Turn the gizmo. Oh, 
Oh, new Wong Fu. What do I got? Doctor. Unstoppable Rat. Divine Drop. Pia. This. Shiver. This is a combo. Ah. The finisher. It all looks cool. I don't think I quick travel back. Uh, wait. Okay. Is it there? Isn't that fast travel? Yeah, it's fast travel. But I'm on the mount. I get out and a shovel. Oh, can. Guess this is going to take some time. This box once tailed a chugger chugger. Now it's just off track. Oh, let's fight these bastards. I'm back. They are Wait. What is he going to do with that? <laughs> He says that's enough scripts to sustain the Mekton's core. <laughs> I'm gonna use that as ammunition. Okay. Well Claw cream. That's Hammond. the special weapon he made to store the scripts in the Mekton. It will be strong enough to launch them at the Jumbo Puff. Gizmo's made via. Yes, that's the Jumbo Puff that I'm going to beat later. It's time to put a stop to the World Eater now, otherwise he fears the damage it's caused to the tree already will be too much to handle. There's time to improve the Mekdon before you confront the Puff. There are more wreck boxes out in the dead zone with gear you should be able to equip the Mekdon. He got the idea to build the Mekdon when he found a big crate containing the metal frame for something Toxanol had named an exoskeleton. Gizmo wants to help if he can. Uh, what am I supposed to be doing? You need to help Gizmo defeat the Jumbo Puff before it destroys the West Fruit. Remembers you as a quiet kid. Gizmo uh, sure, wants sure, to sure. help if Feels he like can. something's missing. The tree remains intact, but you must. Will be around when. Yeah, that sounds like repeating. <laughs> sure, sure, sure. It See. sounds repeating. Okay. Be confusing for a moment there. Jumbo pulse. Let's see. Uh, it's all the way there. That's my character. I want to change the pants though. Looks stupid when I already start pants. Uh, 
but well guys I'm gonna call it for now being a bit uh, tired yeah. fun game so far probably gonna continue tomorrow same time 9 p.m. It looks like a cat. Alright then. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye bye.